Let's see. This is my first time playing on this Pipe Dream server. I think I will be doing a lot of dying. <laughs> is it set on? Uh, I think everything should stay the same, right? So yeah, I'm a complete newbie to this. Don't remove torches. Gotta be away. Ambient blocks from the creature's ambient environments. Let's try that down. I just find the walking around sounds kind of annoying in my ears. So I assume they've lit this all up so that monsters don't spawn in here anywhere. And this is a public server with a uh, ultra hardcore kind of gameplay mode. Nice sound effects of <laughs> walking on the wood. So I've never played in my uh, experience thus far on a public server of any sort. Um, I don't know what note blocks. Well, that's the radio or the disc. Somebody tell me what the uh, sound effects for blocks, maybe? Anyways. Sandstone. All sorts of fun stuff in here. I see, I don't know what's available, what somebody's... Somebody has joined the game, Psycho SFK. I know that, uh, I forget now how to get, get to the console, uh, slash, yeah. So you press the slash key, I guess, to get, uh, the little console up. Oops. Um... Let's see. Holy sheep. <laughs> so there's a couple sheep there. That's where the uh, friendly creatures volume level can go down a little bit. Let's got some... time on a network group server. Um, yeah, I think, I'm assuming when night comes, I'm going to die. <laughs> From what I've seen or heard of ultra hardcore stuff, um, your life doesn't uh, regenerate the same or at all. You're, uh, yeah, and I get kind of nervous about uh, wrecking stuff that other people have made. So, I thought I'd just come on. I was invited by a couple of folks to try it out and uh, and see what's up. But uh, yeah, like I said, I don't really know. Yeah, Viri and Rekomiz. They invited me through my new. YouTube channel. So, I guess... Nice, I didn't think of putting... <laughs> put a crafting table. Oops. Put a crafting table in the floor. That's kind of a neat thing. Neat idea. Double door. Free chicken kills. Sweet. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, there's a whole bunch of chickens in there. Alright, so we'll close that up. Here's some towns, folks. Here's a big stone golem. Oh, this is who I'm talking about. Psycho affects his house. He's got something going on. Fireplace. Hi, yeah. <laughs> so that's a spell book, which I haven't ever. Enchanting book, I guess, which I haven't ever. <laughs> so I think these people are. These are like townsfolks, non playing characters, whatever. Jeez. I gotta get out of here. Uh. Who are doing stuff like you can have them sort of automate and do things for you so nice little house he's got here oh and he's got a horse named mojang holy cows <laughs> yeah so suffice to say i'm the definitely the new guy here uh Escape. So this gives you, I guess, a picture of, of uh, what's possible. Certainly a huge, huge area that's been set up here. Um, All sorts of stuff that I don't even know about yet, but uh, I thought I'd just pop on to check it out. I'm assuming when night falls here, like I said, oh, the zombies start attacking in serious waves, hence all the light here to prevent them from spawning. So I guess I should probably... Uh, Do so oh jeez, sheep. Build a house or something. Try to contribute to society here, but I don't know really wanna see there's no uh as to my knowledge anyways, there's no rules or anything posted anywhere. Nice new flowers, maybe. And this is what's called a portal to the nether. Which takes you to sort of the underworld, deep dark secrets of Minecraft. We won't uh, venture there yet. I've never played that or been on that. All sorts of farms set up, much like you've seen, you know, the very basics of in my other series, uh, dadding my way through Minecraft. Uh, but this is obviously these guys are much, guys and gals are much further along. So, uh, did I go in this house already? I don't think so. Who's this? Thought you make this stuff. Rekamaza. Rekazoma? Something like that. Ooh. Don't judge me, Spawn House. Still working on Spooka. I'm not judging. I guess I need to build a bed at least, hey? Uh, nifty little stuff in here. Yeah, see all these potions and stuff I haven't got into yet. Way more advanced than me. That's common practice, too, is putting, like, a chest, I guess, next to the fields that 
Here's another place I haven't seen yet. Or whose place this might be. Somebody making building in stone as opposed to wood. Nice little view from up here. So there you go, cows. Golem guy, some sort of pond over there. Trees, etc., etc., etc. So, nice little stained glass thing. Hello, sir. Two of them. Let's see who's up here. Public fishing pier coming soon. Reco construction. Help yourself. Oh, yeah, it's a chicken place. be the darkness, which, uh, whoa, there's a spider, and me without any sort of sword, I uh, would die pretty quickly, so, yeah, okay, let's boot it over here, see what happens. So I don't know how meticulous folks are here with uh, the stuff that's in this area. Like, are they watching all the trees and stuff and where that? I don't think that they could be possibly be that meticulous. Oh, he's going up into the tree. Hey, spider. What are you doing? Yeah, hi. Are you stuck up there? Or... Just hiding it out. Oh, I need to eat something too here. I can certainly go find uh, somebody's stove to. You guys are all hanging out in here. How about him? Did he have a stove in here somewhere? No. that all about? I'd like to know. I have a Diamond Fortune 3 pick for rent, Shrek. I have a Silk Touch pick for rent. Garland's Tempos. Interesting. I borrow a piece of wood. Is that allowed? I don't know which is worse, stealing some wood or chopping down a tree. 
Nice little lanterns. Holy cow. That's going down a long ways. Oh, that's the nether I'm hearing, that thing there. Very in record, a horse stable. So yeah, obviously these guys <laughs> at work. Horses are something I haven't come across yet either, so that'll be something to explore and figure out. It's kind of good getting advice or getting ideas for uh, my own little channel. Um, and someday try and catch up and figure out what to do here. Um, not that they've been really helpful and friendly in, in inviting me and knowing that I'm a complete noob to this game. Or to the, well, to the game in general, but also to the type of game that they're trying to play here. I just don't want to screw something up and wreck it or something. I don't know. Ooh. Let's go check this out. Now the daytime is hit. Oops. Ah. Nice. Crazy. Like awesome crazy, not weirdo crazy. Why not a crafting table on the side of a wall? That's brilliant. Chickens in here somewhere. Workstation. Nice little view of the whole. Whew. Thank you. I will uh, return the favor someday, somehow. I can't imagine being far enough down the road to be able to return the favor to any of these folks here, but uh, Flinting Station, that's something I haven't explored yet. Neat idea, actually, keeping this stuff in the floor, kind of. Coal ready to go. Man, but everything's so lit up. Because it's it's nice with it in the floor like that, and it's uh, there, ready to go. But you're not. Uh, you can still walk right over it and unexplored caves. PM me for a good time. <laughs> Interesting. Man, a whole different level, just on a different level as far as, sorry to always be new being out here. Enchantments. All right, so this is where I'd begin to die pretty quickly if I head too far off the broken path here. Fix. Don't fall. Anyways, I do know how to craft tools and stuff, but I'm kind of just exploring. Um, so if anybody from this actual place, this server happens to watch this video, <laughs> I'm kind of just in uh, wide-eyed explorer mode, figuring out what's going on and how things work. Because this is crazy. I've never played in anything this in-depth, as you can tell. Um, 
it's exciting and neat to see. I just am worried I'm going to embarrass myself. <laughs> this is the biggest thing. Might have to stick around at my own little... Oops, I probably shouldn't jump off, hey? That would probably hurt in a bad way. Another little landing here. Oops. <laughs> Something goofy's happening. Okay. There you go. Eggs galore. <laughs> that must be the stairway to heaven. Um, there. Obviously not this way. I'm going to get myself turned around in here already. Chickens. Closed off stairway, right? This is what happens when you don't pay attention to where you're going and you uh, get yourself all turned around. Flinting station. Yeah, I'm just going to end up going down again. <laughs> this is really embarrassing and uh, really newbie move get lost in a man-made cavern. <laughs> See, it's different when you're playing with someone else on someone else's server, uh, or I just feel like there's stuff that I don't know if they've built intentionally or not, and so, yeah. But, I mean, I gotta make some tools. Some tools going. So I'm collecting the different types of wood here. Gonna go find one of the many, 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 many crafting tables hanging around. Get something going. And uh, call it a day, I think, because I <laughs> make us make me maybe make myself a bed and uh, get out of here before I do any serious damage to anything. This is one of the new uh, biomes that I haven't, uh, the Mesa biome. I don't think I've played with too much or on my own channel either. Um, 
Yeah, sorry, there's isn't much commentary this time as I'm... Oh, some stuff's kind of loading kind of weird. As I'm just kind of in... Uh, in what the heck is going on mode. There's some wool. So you buy the stables. Oops. Get some wood planks here. Oops, what am I doing? I've forgotten everything I've taught myself. How to make a stick, for example. <laughs> Oops, and how to make tools. <laughs> Let's stick you there, you there, you there, you there. I don't really want a hoe, I want a uh, axe. And, uh, pickaxe and a shovel. And a sword. So I have some stuff. <laughs> there you go. Thanks, Psycho F. Psycho. So, let's see what I've got here now. Get rid of my wooden sword. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Put on some boots. Put on some leggings. Put on some hats. Give myself a bow. Potion of fire resistance. So I'm going to just make a bed. Uh... Oh. <laughs> Thanks, man. Where do I build my house? 
Ja. So yeah, if you're playing with more than one person, <laughs> hello, sir, uh, you cannot skip to, to morning until... Uh <laughs> I'm just going to follow him for a couple more minutes. Uh... But it has potential for a lot of fun, I think, playing this multiplayer. Um, but <laughs> definitely a little overwhelming. So... Uh... I'm sorry for the, like I said, lack of commentary. Scotty's Imaginarium. Welcome. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Somebody likes Babe. Poster on the wall. Swig. Sweet. Nice. Lots of nicely designed houses, different styles. I like it. I don't know what kind of style I'd... Noob to Minecraft etiquette. So obviously lots of people have built temporary houses. No big deal. Sure gain. I don't want to... Yeah. <laughs> Crafting or enchantment. All right, well, as long as nobody boos that bed, I guess I am okay. Um, I'm just going to say, God, I, for now, thanks for the help. Check out your channel and... Hope to see you again on...
community storage area. All right. Thanks for watching. Um, <laughs> sorry for the boring video. I'll I'll decide when I come back again for uh, to have a little bit better, more entertaining video of this sort. Um, nice little signs here labeling what what goes in these chests. So I would assume these are like community chests. Um, I don't imagine you would probably really, didn't probably enjoy this video that much, so I, I won't feel too bad if you don't give it a thumbs up or if you haven't even watched this far. Uh, episode 2, which I'll try another time, hopefully we'll have a little bit more excitement in it. I'll start building a house, getting familiarized with the server here on Pipe Dream, and uh, many thanks to uh, folks for having me on, despite my noob, uh, newbie uh, abilities. But uh, I'm looking forward to learning lots, so... Until next time, we'll see you later.